If I'm positive, they're bad. Oh my gosh, I just got a... Oh! Hey guys, Derek here, bringing you another Shatterline gameplay. Really been enjoying this one. Uh, more so because I kind of miss that, like in Iron Sight, you can only stack with three. This game, you can go up to six stacks. We actually had a group of five guys on last night, made for a really fun session. It felt really nice to be able to like play as a team and, and like actually have to cooperate to perform well. It felt really good. Um, more rewarding for getting wins and whatnot. But uh, here we have two games where... Uh, one, we had a 19 KD and a 23 KD, so we're just going to bring you a bit of that gameplay. Um, the games right now has been feeling really good. I have another gameplay that's going to be coming shortly. It's going to be, I'm going to kind of call it like a sneak peek to um, competitive. It was one game that was actually like really close. It came down to the wire. Uh, everyone's actually like fast communicating, working as a team. Um, it just felt like really good. And the enemy team was also very strong, so we actually had to put in put in some work to hold them off and it's it's all basically this game mode that you're seeing here where we're pushing the um objective to the other side of the map uh makes for a lot of good uh like you need strategizing maybe you guys need further back with dmrs maybe you need um you know guys hitting flanks with like smgs so you know it makes for a really cooperative type of game mode which has been really fun so more to come on that in the next gameplay that uh i guess i'll call it like a sneak peek into what competitive play will look like um, that's kind of what this game is lacking at the moment. Um, there's a couple things that I'm not too happy about. Just the progression right now seems very, very slow in comparison to other games. Um, like unlocking guns and attachments. It's very in-game currency costly and just takes a long time. Um, so we had a four-hour session yesterday and I got the second AR unlocked and then like maybe an attachment or two. Um, and that's all we did in four hours. So like... We're going to be playing more, we're going to be unlocking more, but I feel like it does take a while. And of course, um, as I mentioned in a couple other videos, there's some movement things I'd like to change, like sliding. Um, when you when you jump, like landing, it's like, oh, this is actually funny. He goes behind cover and then kicks the box out of, uh, he kicks himself away, or kicks his cover away from him, and then I get a free kill. That was actually kind of funny. Um, I completely lost my train of thought from the last topic, but video is coming to an end here. Um, hope you guys enjoyed this, and we're going to be having another upload shortly on more of a competitive game. Um, yeah, so stay tuned for more Shatterline, but having really fun, a lot of fun with this game.